The team made its debut in 1908 as a semi-pro squad known as the Akron Indians. Playing in the Ohio League, the team would win the championship in 1908, 09, 13, and 14. Akron would acquire players such as quarterback Peggy Peratt. Peggy would become player, coach, and owner-manager. He would rename the team Peratt's Indians. In 1906, historians believe Peratt threw the first ever legal forward pass in pro football history. The receiver was Dan the Bullet Riley. Being a football celebrity, Peggy would be a part of two NFL committees during the 1920s. They also recruited notable talents from Notre Dame, including Newt Rockney. Newt would go on to become a legendary coach of the Fighting Irish. Under Coach Rockney, Notre Dame would become national champions in 1919, 1920, 24, 29, and 1930. In 1916, the Burkharts Brewing Company took over the Indians. The team was renamed the Akron Burkharts. After the 1919 season, financial losses caused the team to be sold. The buyers were Art Ranney, a former football player from the University of Akron, and Frank Need. After the purchase, the club was renamed. The pros would join the newly formed American Professional Football Association in 1920, or as it's known today, the National Football League. Akron would play their first NFL home game at League Park, defeating the Wheeling Stooges 43-0. At the end of the 1920 season, the pros would finish with a record of eight wins, zero losses, and three draws, winning the first NFL championship. Much of the pro's success can be attributed to star running back Fritz Pollard. Fritz was not only one of the first black NFL players, but also co-head coached Akron in the 1921 season, becoming the NFL's first African American coach. Fritz would be inducted in 2005 to the Pro Football Hall of Fame. Following the 1925 season, the team returned to its original name, Akron Indians. Due to financial problems and poor on-field performance, Akron would suspend operations in 1927. The team folded the next year. Johnny was bashful and shy. Nobody understood why Mary loved him. All the other girls Everyone wanted to know how she could pick such a bow with a twinkle in her eye. She 